guys welcome back to my channel today again i have a new review video mondays are only for review videos every monday there will be a new review video unless i don't have a new product i won't be having a review video on monday but i will try my best to review new things every monday so mondays are only and only for reviews i actually was doing a lot of reviews last year during november december and so on because there were so many foundation and new foundations coming out and i was doing continuous reviews so i don't want to do that kind of gets a little bit boring not a little bit kind of gets boring so i've decided mondays are only going to be only for reviews and review on a new product if it is eyeshadow palette there will be swatches to tour if there is a foundation there will be foundation routine and so on so mondays are for reviews so review monday let's call it review monday let's call it review monday so today i'm gonna do the review on the new natasha denona's love collection she has come out with this love collection there is eyeshadow palette cheek palette three lip glosses but i have got only three lip glosses lip balm so yeah today will be the review on all these things and i'll give you all these watches i'll let you know all the information about this whole collection for sure that is what this video is all about so let's just start the video and before starting the video please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever i upload a video the link to my instagram is also there in the description below so if you want you can check it out because usually when i try a new eyeshadow palette or a foundation whatever it will be i do a separate video on youtube and i use the same thing and i do a different video on instagram the video i usually do on youtube i do a quick tutorial if it is possible i do the same thing i just make a one minute video of that and i post it on uh, instagram and then later on again i do a new separate video and i do a complete different look for instagram so if you want you can check it out because i do create different eye looks and uh, i do skincare videos there so if you want you can check it out and thank you guys for liking my videos and subscribing to my channel i am very very thankful and please do share it with your friends and family and if they if they are interested in makeup videos please let them know and even my hubby's channel link is there in the description below he has a gaming channel so if you are interested please do and subscribe to his channel also and yeah guys please please be careful please take all the precautions coronavirus that is going on please please be careful of that avoid going out if it is possible please do avoid going out and just take precautionary measures and be safe stay safe eat healthy eat at home don't eat from outside the person who eats from outside from outside is also saying that but yeah please please do don't eat from outside just avoid for a little bit of time i'm very sure things will get better soon it was very important to just put it out because yeah it is kind of serious uh, just be safe be careful wash your hands properly let's just dive in the video don't want to make this video very very serious so yeah let's just start the video so i'll give you all the swatches and everything about the video i'll tell you the price also so going on to the eyeshadow palette first let me show you the eyeshadow palette so this is the outer sleeve of the eyeshadow palette she had come out with this collection during uh, valentine's day i'm very very sure but here in middle east it kind of released a little bit late but it's okay i'm launching the products much faster than they used to so i'm glad about it so i got the eyeshadow palette if you must have seen i think i had uploaded the haul video on thursday on look fantastic it released much earlier than in sephora so i had ordered the entire collection but the pal eyeshadow palette and one lip gloss it kind of shipped i think the second day and then again i got a mail that the cheek palette and the other lip gloss they had low stock and they were waiting for the stock to arrive so it would take around 15 20 days so i immediately told them that i want to cancel it because when it shipped and i got it in mail i got i saw on sephora that it was released on sephora website as well as app i told the look fantastic team i had mailed them that i want to cancel the cheek palette as well as the other lip gloss so they actually did it the same time that i told them to cancel but the only thing is the eyeshadow palette as well the entire collection of the this love collection was a bit pricey on look fantastic so please don't order from them i usually recommend look fantastic but for this collection if you want please purchase it from sephora because 
on Sephora. It is it has actual price. This is for 255. I paid 300 on Look Fantastic, and there was no discount. Also, usually they have 15% discount on the entire website. They usually have that, but on this collection they didn't have. The lip glosses were for 105 dirhams, but on there it was for 120 dirhams. So I'm glad I cancel the cheek palette as well as the other lip gloss anyways this is the eyeshadow palette i know it was kind of long but i want to give you all the information possible i don't want to give you any wrong information whatever is possible and whatever i do check i surely let you know guys so this is the eyeshadow palette is there in the collection it is the natasha denona love collection love palette collection i don't know like why do i say love collection palette so from inside it looks like this pretty pink color very very similar that is why I, I wore a pink top so this is how the palette looks i think this is the only palette that has the plastic packaging other all her palettes are made up of leather kind and only the tiny ones are of plastic but i think this is the only one which has plastic packaging so yeah this is how the palette looks and it has 15 eyeshadows from all the big palettes this is the smallest of all which has 15 shades and this is the cheapest i mean it for 20 255 dirhams and the other sunrise sunset palette i think even they are for around 300 to 500 and they range up to 900 and so on 900 dirhams i'm saying in dirhams don't be confused in that so from inside it looks like this it has 15 eyeshadows they have mattes metallics duochrome stop coats so these are all the palettes it has a beautiful range of mauves pinks rosy tones silverish goldenish plums very very pretty so this palette is for 65 dollars and in middle east from sephora website you get it for 255 dirhams so this palette has 15 shades of natasha denona's signature eyeshadow formulas in pink smoves purples coral silver neutral rich burgundy and a fiery red that melt together in perfect harmony and it can create bold looks to neutral looks to everyday looks depending on whatever kind of looks you want and it has pure color pigments dazzling chroma crystals luminous mineral pearls for maximum color payoff with minimal effort shades and formulas were hand designed by world renowned makeup artist natasha denona and a buttery smooth hydrating eyeshadow formula wears beautifully on any skin type and skin tone paraben free cruelty free and it is made in italy and as you can see the names are written at the bottom of each shadow so that is better rather than putting on the back side of the palette because nobody is interested to just look back again and again when you're using the eyeshadow so i'm glad the names are written on the bottom of the eyeshadows this is how the eyeshadow palette looks then i'll show you the cheek palettes so this is the cheek palette it has four cheek colors so you have two creams and two powder shades i would actually love if the uh, eyeshadow palette was, was also like this it would be very very pretty this is a limited edition collection so i'm not sure whether it would be available usually they are limited edition but they, you can find it on the website i mean the gold palette was also limited edition but you can still find it and that is the most beautiful eyeshadow palette i have ever seen in my life i want that but it is for 500 dirhams i mean very very expensive but there is no compromise in the quality of the eyeshadows not not even any compromise in the mattes metallic shades but depending on i'm not saying you need to buy these pricey palettes but i'm just saying if you want one good palette and if you are willing to pay money go for natasha denona because it is very very good and you will hear nothing but seriously good things about the eyeshadow palettes and actually i forgot to tell you there is a huge mirror also as you can see there is a huge mirror in the eyeshadow palette and there is a huge mirror in the cheek palette as well i have not removed the plastic because i'm okay with it so please don't mind that so as you can see these are the four cheek colors so the, so the top row is cream product and the bottom one is powder so it looks like this and i don't know whether you can see but here actually the creams are covered with this plastic so when you are using the powders it won't fly into the cream and mix up because sometimes brands don't do this and they put creams into the eyeshadow palettes or the face palette and it kind of gets messed up so it is very thoughtful that she has put this plastic thing on top of the cream product so this is the glow cream base it is very pretty corally pink color and, and it has i mean it has a bunch of golden glitter particles and it is very similar to the lip balm that she has come out with then we have 
the shade super glow and that is also very very pretty then we have the powder shades which are diamond powder this pink color and it has a bunch of glitters to it so i'm not sure on your face on your skin how it would look and then we have the glow powder glow impact powder i think you can use this as your highlighter so the cheek palette is for 55 dollars i mean the difference in the price point of the eyeshadow palette and the cheek palette is not a lot the palette is for $65, the cheek palette is for $55. It is not necessary that you need to buy both but depending on what, whether you are an eyeshadow person or a cheek kind of person, I'm just saying I love blushes so I don't mind. The cheek palette has her iconic glow formulas. Natasha presents a set of few easy to use pro level blush and highlighting techniques with a new love cheek palette in picture perfect pink. These lightweight but hydrating creams and powders allow you to achieve the ultimate in luminous luxury. So the shade super glow it is a self illuminating celestial wave of sequin like reflections to give eyes a beaming finish. The weightless veil of glistening pearls wrap lids in oh my god such high undo type of words will color feels velvety as pearl metallic pearls evenly glide across lids for a stellar effect can be used on eyes and cheeks i mean they use such kind of words and so you will feel it would be very very good but i i mean it is very very good don't get me wrong but things make it much more better and the glow impact powder weightless and pure leaf polished finish imperfections are hidden as skin is optically smoothed and te retextured purely luminous veil wears like silk and pearlescent glistening pigments guarantee true to life color and radiance on skin it is fragrance free talc free paraben free made in italy they also have given directions how to use it so use the glow cream base with a makeup sponge finger or highlighting brush and apply it on the highest points of your cheeks wherever you want to use it apply the super glow or the over the glow cream base using a blush or a highlighting brush to elevate your glow top the glow impact powder on to any highlighting points you like to emphasize for a crystalline sparkling glow apply the diamond powder using your fingertip so we'll try out that and in middle east it is on the sephora website it is for 215 dirhams now it is actually out of stock so it is kind of not showing on the on the page and as well as on the app but i'm not sure whether in store it would be available or not so please do check it if you want to buy it then going on to the lip gloss i got the two so these are the natasha denona lip ophoria gloss and balm she has three shades and the shade are duochrome coral nude and mauve so i only got duochrome coral and nude i don't know mauve didn't speak to me so i just didn't buy so these are the two colors both have beautiful shimmers and glitter particles to it as you can see this shade which is duochrome coral is very similar the super glow powder i think this is the powder one so it is very similar to this and this and then you have the shade nude this is a nude color and if you can see there's tiny glitter particles to it so it looks very very pretty so these are for 26 dollars each and on uh, sephora middle east it is for 105 dirhams it is an extra pampering lip balm to soothe refresh and reawake chapped and dry lips enriched with moist and repair active that promotes the collagen delivers into the lips ensuring short and long-term plumping filling and hydration while also improving the elasticity its crystal like brilliance intensifies the color vibrancy flooding the lips with super juicy shine lips are younger fuller and perfectly defined lips stay moist and protected while the presence of peppermint oil gives relief with a long-lasting cooling sensation and it has a comfortable 8-hour wear and it is packed with pure color pigments and which gives your lips luminous to a chrome color it gives you a supple gloss sheen and it has one swipe payoff it will smooth the texture of your lips as well and it is paraben free oil free mineral oil free cruelty free vegan made in italy these were the few information that i want to let you know so let's see we'll try out the lip gloss let's see till at the end of the video how it is gonna turn out because my lips are kind of dried up so i'll use the shade duochrome coral it smells really nice it smells like pe peppermint so <gasps> that is a very pretty shade i mean seriously very very pretty and seriously the texture is like a balm and it has peppermint scent and um, so it will actually even plump your lips i have never used any plumping lip glosses any such i'm not interested i'm my lips are actually very very dry so yeah let's get into all the swatches because 
that everyone actually seriously loves actually today i want to do a monochromatic look that is why i'm wearing this pink top because i want to do pink kind of uh, lipstick pink eye look and usually natasha denona's eye looks are very very pretty on her instagram page she does diffused eye looks not half cut crease any of that sort so it looks very very pretty so i want to do something of that sort Firstly, I'll do the swatch of the Love Glow palette and I am very very sorry. I think only this one is cream product and this is a powder. So firstly, we will actually swatch the shade Glow Creme Base. So this is how it looks. It is a cream product. So we will actually try that out. Then we have the shade Super Close. Sorry, this is a powder shade but this is also the similar to the lip gloss that I'm wearing. that is very very pretty i mean even you can use these shades on your eyelids then we have the diamond powder in the diamond powder you can actually feel the glitter parts but i mean it is very very pretty that is so 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 pretty i mean then we have the shade glow impact powder this you can use as your highlighter that is stunning so these are the swatches it looks pretty pretty good so let's just swatch the eyeshadow quickly also please ignore this this is due to my top so first we have the shade first it is a very light i mean it is a cream color so this is how it looks and we have the shade lifetime which is a shimmery metallic shade I mean metallic shimmer shades should be like this. It's stunning. Then we have the shade Heartbeat which is not exactly a red but it is brownish kind of red. Very very pretty. And we have the shade Transparent which is more of a champagne shimmer shade. That is gorgeous. Then we have the shade Trust which is a nice purple eyeshadow. Then we have the shade heart. I think this is the red color that she talks about in the description. And it is a very pretty actually red color. Very very pretty. And we have the shade giving which is very similar to the lip gloss and the shade duochrome coral shade. So it has a ton of pinks peach and golden shimmers to it but in pan it looks corally peach color then we have the shade pure love this is a i think even this is a duochrome purplish pink color then we have the shade commitment this is a matte shade or a shimmer shade i'm not actually sure but I don't know whatever that texture is it is pretty pretty good I mean I love how rich that is then we have the shade blind this is a silverish color but I mean I I think it has a little bit of purple undertone I mean little but I saw the swatch of this on her Instagram page and it was <gasps> I mean that is stunning I will actually put this like this because that texture on my hand is not looking pretty then we have the shade soul it is a very pretty rosy shade then we have the shade passion which is again a darker rosy brownish kind of a shimmer shade very very pretty then we have the shade intense this is more of a corally matte shade similar to what I am actually wearing then we have the shade Valentine which is a light, very light pink shade. And then we have the shade Dream. This is a purple matte shade. Not exactly dark purple but purple purple. So as you can see, these are the swatches. Very very pretty. So actually I am thinking that I will do the tutorial and then after the tutorial I am going to actually give you my final thoughts, my reviews because while doing my tutorial if I talk the video gets too long. I mean 
too too long and so better i do my i shall total first and then i will give you my uh, final thoughts and my reviews about the eyeshadow palette so i'll just be right back So guys I completed my entire tutorial I even showed you both the lipsticks and I have paired this lipstick with the bullet lipstick because I wanted something below the lip gloss because uh, I mean it is very very beautiful but I wanted something a base to put below the lip glosses so I seriously love the eyeshadow palette as you saw it went so beautifully I mean I love this shade giving this is very very beautiful i don't know whether you can see it or not but in pan it looks kind of peachy goldeny and it has a ton of purple pink undertones and the duochrome so it is very very pretty i mean that is one of my favorite shades and the shade heart i mean it is red but it is very very beautiful doesn't look very loud or very bold or very i mean you know when you apply red it looks like you have fever so it doesn't actually look good and as you can see it is so so beautiful duochromatic shade and i seriously love this palette i mean there is nothing wrong about the palette the mattes blended beautifully the shimmers duochrome metallic shades are so damn beautiful i think it is such a beautiful palette if you want to buy if you want to try out i would highly recommend it because it is very very beautiful and seriously very 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 good i mean i love the color and even the shade soul is a very beautiful rosy pink color that you can use every day and it is very very pretty it blended like a dream so this shade commitment is also very very rich plum blackish kind of a color it looks very pretty that is what is there on my lower lash line it is very very beautiful i mean i am in love with this palette what else do i need to say it is so so beautiful and this cheek palette i simply love it as you saw in this tutorial i used all the four shades and i am highly impressed with this shade which is diamond powder i mean if you have used the fenty beauty highlighter in the shade uh, in the shade how many carrots uh, the one which is purely glitter with no base but it doesn't exaggerate your pores it doesn't look if you have a textured skin you won't i mean i 
I don't have a very smooth smooth skin but I have topped it up on my higher points of my cheeks on my brow bone in my inner corner I mean I just went everywhere on my face it is very very beautiful so if you like that highlighter from Fenty Beauty how many carrots I'm very very sure you will love this shade I used my fingers to blend the cream but later on I used a brush uh, so I used the real technique buffing brush I have used this for my cream so it went really really well it blended very very nicely then I topped it up with this powder which is the super glow and then on top of that i have used this just on my high points and my brow bone it is looking very very pretty i i am very very impressed with this color i mean in pan it looks so bold such a i mean i don't like this type of pink colors i mean i think it is a barbie kind of pink but i simply don't love it but i don't know it as you can see it doesn't have any base to it i i don't know what how do i explain it to you but if you have used even the huda beauty mini palettes she has the shimmer shades which doesn't have any base but it uh, it looks duochromatic so similarly this is how it looks only when you use it on your face you will only see the shimmer parts and not any base and it would look very very pretty i'm very sorry i don't know the exact words what to use but i seriously can't explain how beautiful it is i mean if you are a blush fanatic if you love blushes i i'm very sure you will love this palette because it is very very pretty i didn't want to buy an expensive palette and then regret it but it is expensive so i actually want to work and it worked really beautifully i'm not saying because it is very very expensive and i wanted to do a positive review that is why i'm doing it but no it's not like that it really worked very very well i am sure you have seen in the tutorial it looked very very beautiful i mean i am very very impressed and the lip balms are also very very good i'm not sure i i can't use this on its own because it is very very duochrome corally but during summer season if you love to go on beaches if you uh, are a summer kind of a person i'm very sure this would look very beautiful and if you have a tan skin it would look seriously very very beautiful and even this nude color is very pretty but i would not use it on its own i would use maybe a lip liner or a lipstick below it just because i like it that way and if i have used the lipstick sour in the shade sour and on top of that i have used the shade duochrome coral so it is not looking as vibrant so that is what i'm liking it but i'm not saying you 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 don't need this in your collection but the palette and the cheek palette is very very beautiful so if you want to try anything from the love collection i would recommend the eyeshadow palette as well as the cheek palette because it is very pretty if you are a blush up person then only go for the cheek palette because if you don't love blushes if you don't like glitter particles shimmer particles you won't like it and it will actually not exaggerate your pores yeah but the eyeshadow palette if you want to try i would highly highly recommend i know it is a bit pricey i'm not saying that you need to buy i mean even if it is not in your eyeshadow palette collection you won't feel bad but depending on how much you love makeup how much you love eyeshadows how much you how much you love the intensity of how much you love makeup according to that you would buy or you wouldn't buy but i would highly recommend the cheek palette as well as the eyeshadow palette is very very beautiful i am glad that i got this collection and i am actually looking forward to purchase more from natasha denona it is pricey but seriously i want to try out because they are very very good and rather than having thousands of other eyeshadow palettes which don't work that great i would i i would prefer these palettes because they work beautiful and i love a good shimmer metallic shade because that what makes an eyeshadow complete i mean i have never tried out matte eyeshadows but i mean this looks good i know this is not everyday kind of a thing but still it looks pretty good it is very very pretty i would highly 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 recommend this collection so if you like this video please give a thumbs up let me know in the comments below whether you like this video whether you like the style of the video or not and um, please let me know whether you have tried out or whether you are going to purchase the this collection from natasha denona or you have tried any other products or any other eyeshadows from natasha denona please let me know in the comments below if you like this video please give a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family and yeah guys i'll see you soon in my next video bye